Oh, you guys are here? Oh, let me take these off. This is this is what today's episode is about. I wanted to show you guys what I've been working on. If you guys saw this device in a previous video, this is supposed to hold these headphones on either side. I'm still working on that and possibly tuck them in for storage in there. But this is a touch screen, a DVD player, and the sensor for these guys. Computer, hard drive, and a battery power switch, a case, right? So that was one, that was one. This was the other version that we were working with, right? I left the, the, case, the original case intact, and this has a storage spot for your favorite music device or tablet can fit safely, safely there, right? Um, and then in here is storage space for your battery, right? The charges and powers everything. And you can just take out the battery, replace the battery, and keep going, and then charge that battery. Right? And then this is meant to sit. Hold on. This is meant to sit and hang on the wall or sit on a shelf. Right? And then you can just take and use the headphones as needed. Or you can take the whole thing with you and then bring it with you. The idea was to bring it to a job site or places with you work and set it there and you have your communication device. And then to go a step further, right, we thought about storage spot for the batteries, right, and so we got this little container. And this one we decided to put two on it, right, and then there's a DVD drive, a little tray to hold SD cards, and then on the back would be a hinged door to hold the computer and a Wi-Fi router and here would be the computer computer would sit there and the Wi-Fi router um, and this is a prototype design of the next version of what I showed you oh we're also thinking about holding putting some speakers on this that'll tuck inside of it right so that way they can be on it and you could just broadcast with speakers if you don't want the headphones and have that as an option right or take these and plug them into something else and have them right there so you can test them so what's missing in the final design was storage space for the action camera so we can have the camera with us at all times and stored stored neatly and possibly a spot to charge it in case it needs charging or the SD cards, I showed you the SD card tray. And then the only other last thing would be storage spot for the mouse, right? So that way you can keep your mouse nice and tucked in and have spare batteries for it in case you need to grab it and use it. So these two things I wanna try to squeeze into the next iteration. But what I've come up with from a 3D printed um, design off Thingiverse, I'm going, to give, I'm going to tip the guy and give the guy a shout out uh, we'll put up his information here when I when I have it. The switch, some you got your power in, power out. I added a fuse so you could pull the fuse out and change it in case it broke, and put the power leads in, and it snaps into a battery, just like this commercially available one that you can get off the shelf that works just fine, but it only has one input, and it has limitations. This one slides right on, and then I can put it in the device. So you're asking what is all the hubbub, what I come up with is this is, I recently decided to put this, an inverter on board so that way we could charge the laptop. So if we had this device with us and we were, power went out or whatever, you could plug your laptop into here and charge your laptop for about an hour or so, depending upon the size of the battery. And the battery just comes out and removes, excuse me, and you can take a freshly charged one and stick it in there and then the idea here is to take and remove the headphones and the stand from this one migrate them to here right I need to add uh, a couple things to this real quick before I mount it in here this 3d printed part would be hard mounted in there 
and then you can physically remove the battery right and this is watertight storage and then there's a drawer here for storage of your SPDIF cables right or your other audio cables and charging cables that you may want to put in here I'm also thinking about putting an SD card spot right in there as well and then you can pull that out and get your cables if needed and then this all buttons up and could sit neatly on the wall and be there and then you can go walk around and have your communication set everything set up so thought I'd take this is the meat and the bones of it just a 3d printed sled with a switch and a fuse this one I didn't incorporate it in it I have it on the outside at the moment um, and then this fancy case that I made which if you can see this I started with a design just like this out of the same material which is a foam board with covered in paper hot glued it together covered it in fiberglass sanded it fiberglass sanded it bondo sanded it more bondo and sanded it and sanded it and then bondo a little bit and sanded it and then I painted it and sanded it and then I painted it a few more times and sanded it and then I put some gap filler in and then s sanded it and then I painted it sanded it and I think I painted it one more time and we're at this point there's about two cans of spray paint um, a wee bit of fiberglass it's a bit heavy um, especially since I've added the inverter but I think the inverter is a good touch because um, you never know when you might need power this is a low inverter you could add a bigger one if you wanted and you had the extra battery space but this is about a hundred um, watts my laptop uses about 90 so should be okay for um, quick usages when, when needed but we th I thought I'd show you before I went and ripped this thing all apart and took the, this off here the, um, the latching mechanism here for this part will be hook and latch right it's fantastic you will put some adhesive here and um, the rough part of the hook and latch here and then the hook and latch on the bottom part of this so I could take off this part put it in my bag and take it with me and leave this and just take the cables that I may need right and then this is an organization system for everything that you may need as far as cables and in future going to have it broadcast Wi-Fi have a computer on board storage for my um, camera my mouse the speakers possibly it'll be a bit heavier it'll be a bit bigger maybe it'll have a beefier inverter right but um then we'll have and then and then there's this one and if you really want to go overboard there's an option with this one has the computer on board with a 10 inch 10.1 inch touchscreen right in case you wanted um, touchscreen capabilities I'm also thinking about adding a hinged lid to keep the dust and stuff off and to protect this from weather elements and from things hitting it you know in case you want to bring it and use it places um, but yeah we'll have some updates for this I'm working on having some more updates for this there's um, some buck converters and regulators are coming in the mail we should have those here shortly we'll show you some updates with those once they come in um, and I also have this this design too I got it backwards sorry about that this design too which has two plugs oh I don't think I showed you that so that had spots for two this one has a spot for one and it fits nice and snug and it won't fall out even when you push it all the way up in there and this holds double-a batteries perfect size so I can hold enough double-a batteries spaces for charged ones and then spaces for the depleted ones so you put the depleted ones in there and then have your charged ones um, as well and then they fit nice and in there um, but yeah the other thing that wasn't thought about was storage space for the projectors um, got a couple of projectors that are kind of small um, that could fit nicely in there and could do some crazy things um, that may also be on a future design for doing like whiteboards and broad and displaying um, advertisements and weird stuff but yeah there's um once you got some portable power 
right? And you got a case to store everything. There's some crazy things you guys can do. Um, I hope this has been an inspiration for you guys and give you guys some creativity on things you might be able to do. If you need us to build something for you, want us to do something, let us know. That's what we're here for. I thought I'd take a quick minute to show you what I've been up to. Um, oh, the other thing I didn't mention is this is going to have um, a file storage system on it. So like a portable NAS device, right? And the end all be all is when this plugs into the network and you have your network, there will be a huge hard drive here to store all your files and interact and then that way you have a NAS device that all your machines can interact with and have a localized storage system for everything and that way if in case a machine goes down, something happens, you have a backup. And then you back this up to have a redundant backup in case this guy fails. Trust me, I've had external hard drives fail. That happens. You need to have backups. Don't forget about your backups. And that's part of where this comes in is not only did I want a safe and secure spot to have this and have this be usable in more capabilities, I also want to be able to have the power needed for the storage and file storage and all that. And what happens when the power goes out and I have all these batteries kicking around and what if I could use them to power my laptop? And then off the same device I have right next to me anyway, just plug the laptop in. Um, but yeah, we've got more coming for you. There's other designs on other products. This happens to be one product line for wireless headphones and music or communications because while the end all be all is you can listen to your music, this also has a microphone and you can do communications and chats and things like that and not be tethered. Um, while these happen to be my favorite wired headphones and I repaired them the other day with some hot glue my buddy broke them on me but um, I repaired them with some hot glue these happen to be 18 years old they still work perfectly right but you got this long cord and it can get caught on stuff and if you just gotta go run away somewhere and then you take it off and then you're not you can't keep on with the communication um, the conversation you're having or if you just had your favorite song on, or your favorite podcast, you won't be able to listen to it. But um, this system's meant to work with any any device. It's just the idea here is all the electronics, the case, and the storage, right? As you can see, and then you add your transmitters or your computers and the parts that you would want to customize a solution for what you're ultimately trying to do. This here is supposed to be a portable storage space for all your music and all your files, be able to broadcast them and transmit them to your favorite music listening devices, and be able to take your other music devices and put them in and, and use them on the same device, or plug your laptop into this and then have this be powered, you know, use it through that. So it's a laptop accessory type device for your office to help, um, you know, help with your listening pleasure or communications if you need to do because that's one of the great things about this is you can put these on and do phone calls and all the outside noise gets distracted and stuff like that um, appreciate your time I hope that was informative um, I tried to get it all out there for you the, um, the big part is storing all these cables and so that way you have all these cables nice and neat and managed and you can grab the ones that you want Right, and just be able to go ch -ch -ch, grab them and go. Check that out. Anyway, before I break anything else, I'll leave you guys to it. Thank you guys for watching. I appreciate your time. Just see that $170 computer go flying across the room. Hopefully, hopefully she's still good. If you guys don't know, it's a WAN board. Pretty awesome device. Um, yeah, we'll go into more details on it here. Thought I just commented on it going across the room. <laughs>